jump. Tap when I speak, I'll cap with the speech till they cut up in the rap. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I want to show you how I make my intro. So first thing I'm gonna do is go inside of the Fonto app, which is that little red one with a P and the pencil. And then I'm gonna go in and hit the camera and click plain image. And I want a black one because that's the background. And I want to click the box up top and click the iPhone 11 Max horizontal one. And then I'm gonna go in and hit use. And then I'm gonna go in and add text and type my name. So I go in and choose what type of text I want, but I already had the one that I already liked. So I'm gonna go ahead with that one, but it does have several different options that you could choose from. And then I am going to go ahead and make it to the size that I want. After I've already been chose. And I'm going to hit the color. Just change it to a pinky tone. That's what I've lately been going for is a pink tone. And then I'm going to hit save as a PNG. Next I'm going to go in. Or get add. Next I'm going to add a photo. I'm going to hit the three lines and hit add image. And I'm going to pick the image that I want. And I've already choked, made those that I like. I made these on Procreate and if you want to see a video about that leave a comment down below of how I actually cut around my images and give them to the, the size that I want. And then as I do that I will make sure I save each photo as I go so it'll be like a transition in between each of them. So I'm going to finish this put it at the size that I want and then I'm going to save this image. Now after I figure out the size that I want, oh, I already said save it. I'm going to save it as another PNG. Then I'm going to go back and hit the three lines and add the next image that I want to use. So I went for this image, but I wanted to go on the other side. But I want to use this one. So I'm going to make them go in order as how I want them to pop up. And I'm just going to fit that to the size that I want. Save it. And then I'm going to add in my next image just the one that I was going to use the last time so after I get finished with doing this and making this size I'm going to go into the glitchy app And that's how I make them all types of glitchy which with this I'm going to hit the camera then I'm select the clip that I want to use first which is the first one that I made not with my name with the first one with the picture and then I'm gonna hit check marks and then I'm gonna click the glitchy and I'm gonna go through you have a bunch of different choices that you can make and you are just gonna keep on doing this with the next three Photos that you have, and that's going to help them turn them into videos, and they each are 10 seconds long. So, you're going to be able to cut those down whenever you get finished. So, you're just going to keep on doing that for the next two photos as you got for right now. Backgrounds, I'm going to YouTube and Google in the green screen with the stars and I'm going to go through and find the one that I like and I'm going to share it, copy the link and then I'm going to go into the app document and I'm going to put that into the search bar and I'm going to download that file. Now sometimes it won't download like this and you'll have to hit the down arrow download box at the bottom. Second from the left side of right side for me. And it's just going to download. And you're going to save that.
And you also want to do that for your, what else did I use it for? I kind of recorded it as I went. And you're just going to hit. Well, this is showing you that it's downloading. And then I'm going to go back and just do it also for the subscribe. Um, click sound and everything and I'm also going to do that for my um, little swooshing intro that I like to do. You already see I got those already saved. I already did this before and I'm just going back over to show you guys how I, I did this. And I'm just showing you. Okay so now I'm going to open to iMovie and I'm, I already made this one so I'm going to go back and I'm start a new project and I'm going to hit movie. And I'm going to start off with the title clip that I had. Let me find it. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to hit create a movie. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to size down the clip to the size that I want it to be. And I did forget to turn off my Ken. Well, turn off Ken's Burns and Able before I did this. But now I'm going to go back and hit add a, make a movie. And I'm going to hit the... See what I'm doing. Add my first clip in of me. And I'm going to size it down to what I want it to be. And now I'm going to go in and add my next clip. And I'm just sizing these all down to the size that I, or the length that I want them to be inside of my intro so I'm just shortening them all down to about the length that I want them to do and you have to work with it and make them this, the length that you want to it's going to take trial and error to go back and forth to make it the size of the video that you want now after I size all those down I'm going to start going back in and adding my green screen effects and how I do that is by well, I'm watching it over to make sure it's how I want it to be. And I'm finally turning off the Ken's Burns. And I must make sure that name is exactly how I want it to be on screen. You can just move it around with your fingers. And I'm just going back to watch it. Okay, now that I'm done figuring out how I want everything put in place and messing around for now, I'm going to go back and start adding in my green screen. So I'm going to hit it and then hit the three little dots and I'm going to choose green slash blue screen and I'm going to paste it on top of everything and I'm just going to cut this, the green screen down to high, where I want it to be for the beauty intro thing. And I'm just going to hit split clip. I'm going to tap it, then hit split clip. And delete the rest of it that I don't need. And then I'm going to go back and do the same thing with the other three pieces. So I'm going to go back, hit three dots. Go tap on what I want. Hit the three dots and add it on top. Hit blue slash green screen. And it's going to add the little stars on top of the image. And I'm going to roll it all the way down to the end of how I want it to be. And make sure it does not go too far. But now to get in the subscribe, I have to add in a blank clip. So I'm going to go back and I have a black video, which is just a black clip. And I'm going to add that to the end of this. If I can find it. I'm going to add the clip in. And I'm just going to cut the stars off because with on the phone, I can't do it with this program. But with Final Cut, I could add the stars and the other green screen on top of each other. But this is the, this is the way you can do it on the phone, as I stated before. I'm going to go back and just cut this off. And I'm going to go back. And finally add in the subscribe thing because with this 
or I edited it wrong. Delete and do it all over again. But with the subscribe one that I chose to the little ding, I still got a little sound. So I had to go back in and add the clip of the sound. So that that was a good lifesaver. And you can only see the part of the first one, but you can slope slide it down and then add in the other way because the clip is not a big file so you have to cut it down to the size that you want and move the other side to make the rest of the video and that's pretty much all that i did but you can go back and add music that you want on top of or add music to it to your intro which i can show you how in the next video just let me know and i'll show you how to do that but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And just keep on watching it out until I actually finish the video. Bye, guys.